You told what's going on. It's your boy back with some more of that. That knowledge, that free game to give y'all. You know what I'm saying? Because it's important to have trial and error. You know, it's important to know people that have been through some shit. So they can tell you about the outcome of it. And you, you technically don't have to you know, go through the same experience, so, you know what I mean, you can save yourself the trouble, save yourself sitting in jail, you know, save yourself from a whole lot of shit you ain't gotta go through, you know what I'm saying, but anyways, um, today we're gonna be talking about women, okay, women, and men too, but women and their emotions, let's say that, okay, um, so you have different kind of women out there, this is something that I'm noticing, you have different kind of women out there, all right, you got the dress wearing woman, she's humble, she's soft spoken, you know, she's a pleasure to be around, you know what I mean, she wears a dress, you know what I mean, she doesn't talk back, she cooks, you know what I mean, she sucks you without asking, you know, these are traits of a good woman, you know, when I don't have to ask to get my rocks off, those are traits of a good woman, you know, do I not have a lighter right now, oh, this bitch came in here and took the lighter, another trait of a good woman, leave your man a lighter, that's why people can't, you can't keep a man, because you can't leave a lot. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's a lot of problems y'all got now. Anyways, sorry for that. Back to what I was saying. You know, she's, 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 she's humble. She's soft-spoken. You know, those are, those are traits of a good woman. And then you got the ratchet woman. Hmm? You've had a ratchet woman in your life before. Don't look at me like that. You've had a ratchet one before. Let's not lie. All right? Then you got your ratchet woman. You know what I mean? She's not even... You got your ratchet woman. We've all had a ratchet woman. Man, she gives a fuck about everything but you. She gives a fuck about everything but you. But she will tell you every day how she's down for you and this and that and this and that. But she's down for everybody but you. Her friends. The friends that ain't even her friends. Her fake friends. Like just, hey, loud mouth, barely cook. You know what I'm saying? The type that only gonna suck your dick if you go down on them. Like that's bullshit. That's bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes I ain't in the mood to lick the cat. And another thing you ladies gotta understand, you get what you put in. If you're acting like a bitch, the nigga's gonna treat you like a bitch. If he sits here and asks you a question calmly, and you wanna respond like a bitch, you're gonna be labeled a fucking bitch. That's what I don't understand. I hate with a passion a loud mouth woman. I hate it. See, back in middle school, back in middle school, that shit was cute as hell. Oh, my girl got an attitude. Oh, she's so cute. Oh, my girl got an attitude. Oh, it's so cute. It's so sexy. Ah, oh, my girl be talking back. Nigga, who you talking to, bitch? Like, that shit, that shit was attractive back in the day. But as you grow up, that shit gets annoying, bro. I'm going to keep it real with you. That shit gets annoying. I've dealt with all kinds of women. White women. Black women. 
yellow women, orange women, women, women. You know what I'm saying? I like them all. I dealt with a lot of women. You know? And it's like, I know what I want. <laughs> like, I know what attracts me. Nobody wants a woman that's going to sit there. <coughs> you know, no one wants a woman that's always nagging about something. Nobody wants that. Nobody wants the woman that's going to be nagging all the time. It's time to step it up, man. It's time to step it up. There's a few reasons why women act like this. There's a few reasons. You're not doing your job or, you know, you're not hitting it right. You know, you're not providing the bills. And if your woman was a honey with you, you, you tell her this, like, there's a, you know, if y'all actually sat down and had, like, a, a conversation for once and, and you know, put everything on the table and let, let it be known what the fuck the problem is, you can say, well, there's only a couple reasons why you're acting like this, babe, is, well, either I'm not hitting it right or, you know, you're just, you know, you don't care about me, like, hey. I don't, is it because I don't pay your bills? Is it? Is it? Be, they, no matter, no matter what the fuck you say, she's gonna say, "Yep, it's that, it's that, it's that, it's that." It's because she's the fucking demon. That's why. It ain't you, my man. It's not you. <laughs> it ain't you. And she, and then she'll say some shit like, "Well, I found a hotel key. You cheated on me. <laughs> You're sitting here calling me out of my name." Right, doing this, that, this, and that, and you're surprised that you found a hotel key in my bag. You're surprised you found a hotel key in my bag. Wait, you act like a bitch. You claim you don't fuck with somebody, and you you're you're surprised that there was a key in my. You should be surprised that you didn't find another bitch in my bag, huh? You know what I mean? You should you should be surprised another bitch didn't pop out. Hello. You know what I'm saying? That's what you should be surprised about. Shit. I wish a bitch would. Yeah. I wish a bitch would run her mouth and find a hotel key and be like, I found a hotel key in your fucking bag. You're cheating on me. Shit. That's what I would have said. I'll tell you right now. I don't play them kind of games, champ. It's time to level up. You feel me? It's time to level up, yo. And that's a fact, Captain. It's time to level up. You know what I mean? If your woman's not acting right, go get you another woman. You know what I mean? If your woman's not acting right, go get you another woman. You know what I'm saying? Because life is short. Life is fucking short. But anyways, I'm not going to talk y'all ear off, you know, I'm not going to talk y'all ear off, y'all make sure y'all like and subscribe this channel, on this channel, it's going to be a lot of relationship comedy, you know what I mean, you got to come over here and get you a laugh real quick, because your side piece is acting like the main course, you know what I mean, you gotta come over here and get a laugh because your main your main thing is acting like a side of Wendy's fries. You come over here and catch a video. I'm gonna try to drop a video a day for y'all. You know what I'm saying? A video a day. You know? It's just that I feel like I feel like I've been through a good amount with relationships. You know, I feel like I can give that good advice. And then you go have that woman out there like. You can't give advice about a relationship. You don't know how to treat a woman. No, I don't know how to treat you because you're a bitch. But all you other women, <laughs> Dimple, you know I love y'all ladies. You know, slide in my DM. We're going to make it do what it do. But anyways, so come over here for that good relationship comedy. You know, we're going to do some skits. We're going to do a little bit of a little bit of everything. You know, I may do some reactions. or I ain't doing no mukbang 
things and mukbangs. Y'all ain't about to watch me stuff my motherfucking face. You know what I'm saying? But we gonna, we gonna get right. Y'all make sure y'all stick around for some content. 2020, 2020's already been some shit, but let's at least get a couple laughs out of it. You know what I'm saying? So y'all be easy <laughs> and stay tuned.